The weight force is always going to be acting straight down uh, through the centre of the circle, so its distance uh, from the pivot point is always going to be constant. So the, the weight times the distance will be the same. So this, um, what have we got there, an anti-clockwise moment is going to be constant. We want that anti-clockwise moment to be balanced by a clockwise moment from the force on the handle. Now the handle could be in this orientation, this orientation, this orientation. But what you want is the largest distance between the hand, perpendicular distance between the handle and the pivot point. These ones here, the perpendicular distance is shorter. If you had it at that angle there, it would be a shorter distance. This is the largest perpendicular distance you can get from the pivot point. So using, using that there, that is the radius, that's what we've got here, the radius there. We've got the weight of 180, um, this distance here is 0.4. The only unknown is the force that we have to apply here, and that's the minimum force required to lift it up over the step.